Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Adventure 2! Get the mouse off the screen. Okay, anyway. Today we start on the dark story. The little emblem at the bottom of the hero story means we're completely done with it. And we can move on to this one! Hooray! Intruder alert! Intruder alert! Security breach at gate 3. Intruder has been located in the north quadrant and is moving in the direction of the underground base. All units prepare to engage. Emergency battle formations. Standard battle procedures initiated. Locate and stop the intruder from entering the security area. This is not a drill. Repeat, this is not a drill. <laughs> that was all too easy. Let's take a look at what my grandfather was working on. My top secret military weapon. The military shut down the research because they feared it. Thank you for the exposition, Doctor. Intruder alert. Assume level one defense formation. We start playing as Dr. Eggman in this story. And I already know how the controls work because they're very similar to how Tails' controls work. Actually, they're exactly the same. Never mind. But, this story starts earlier than the hero story by, I think, either one mission or two, I can't remember. But, this place should look very familiar. This is pretty much the same prison that Sonic was held captive in, if you remember correctly. And I'm definitely going to get that key because... <sighs> Son of a... Are you kidding me? Come on. I can get it. Move your fat robot, Dr. Eggman! There we go. Oh, yeah. Got it. Cool. But yes, this was the same prison that uh, Sonic was being held captive in the hero story. And we we're just gonna raid this place. I thought I saw a chow box over there, but I guess not. My eyes are playing tricks on me. So let's just continue on through here. We have to keep blowing up these security gates by locking onto all the little mechanisms and firing at the same time. If I'm good, I can get some nice combos going here. And Dr. Eggman is uh, a lot funnier with uh, the way he rejoices after getting really huge combos. Instead of going, okay, he's like, yes! And his, like, faux accent or whatever. I don't even know what kind of accent that's supposed to be, but it's hilarious. I know that much. Oh god. <laughs> that was awesome. I can't believe I targeted all of those past the thing. Now, there's going to be upgrades past this, but we're not going to be able to get anywhere close to it. Uh, so what upgrade is that, actually? I don't know. I can't tell from here. We'll have to come back here eventually for that upgrade. I like how the announcer suddenly just goes, Get him, please! He shouldn't be this far into the base. Come on. Alright. Continue forward. Let's get all this stuff done. Shoot these guys. Grab this little thing. Destroy all those. And we can get our level 4 gate done. I think there are five levels of security in here. So we're over halfway already. Now in the hero story, Dr... Uh, not Dr. Sonic has more upgrades than everyone, but in the dark story, Dr. Eggman has more upgrades with ever than everyone. So Dr. Eggman is actually more powerful than Tails, and... Technically, Sonic is more powerful than Shadow, just because of the amount of upgrades they get. Yep, we're almost to the final security door. Okay. It means we're getting really close here. You'd think they'd get the security on these a little bit better after a while. Realize they're not doing anything against me. I've already blown up the same security door like <laughs> ten times by now. Alright. 
grab a couple of run upgrades. Alright, now what's gonna happen is we're gonna go over here really quick, see this cutscene. That's the final security door. Fortunately for us, though, they decided to give us this nice missile to blow up all of the security doors. Thank you, gun. Yosh! Yosh! Dr. Eggman, Eggman's just so hilarious. He's my f he's one of my favorite dark characters, honestly. <laughs> Piece of cake. I say one of my favorite dark characters, but really there's no character in this game I don't like. I think my least favorite one is Tails, but I, I even I like Tails, so. Eh. <sighs> And you probably hate Rouge right now just because she seems pointless, but in the Dark Story you'll get more of her backstory and what she's about, and you'll probably start to like her. I didn't like her until I got about halfway into the backstory, er, into her backstory. But today, our little friend that we've been making feel so horrible this whole time, we're gonna actually give him things! Because we have a character to give him things. There you go, little buddy. Have some drives and have some other things and feel fantastic. And as you'll notice, he's turning progressively more dark. Because we are trying to turn him into a dark child. Just like we turned the other one into a hero child. I'm tempted to run over there and pick him up and throw him just for posterity. <laughs> But he's he's having such a good time because he can he can actually swim. Is that a bunny? Pick, grab the bunny. Give it to this guy. Take the bunny. Yay! Yes. <laughs> An evil chow with bunny ears. How how great. How wonderful. Okay. So that's a, that little guy. secret weapon. It's a lot smaller than I expected. Enter user data. Uh -huh. Enter password. Password is Maria. Maria. Now all I have to do is to place the Chaos Emerald into this console. Rise, Lord Vader. Oh, oh. Is that you, son? Are you trying to spoil my plans again? Wait a minute. You're not Sonic. This is impossible. My name is Shadow. Since you were so kind to release me, my master, I will grant you one wish. Now what? Behold the true power I possess. This is Scorpion Troops Hotshot. Enemy movement has been detected. En route to intercept and destroy. This boss is gonna look really familiar. Considering we've already really beaten him once. Um, he has one difference compared to the first boss we fought in City Escape. And he might do it. Might not. I don't know. But what he has that the boss in City Escape didn't have is this. This targeting ability. This does a lot of... Actually, it doesn't do any damage if it hits you because it just gets your rings gone. I think. Never mind. But with this guy, I think we're gonna just hang back and wait for him to land. 
But as you can see, Shadow controls much like Sonic, only he has roller skates. Evil roller skates. That are completely and totally the most badass things I've ever seen. Oh crap. I decided to get a little risky there. The Scorpion troops hot shot. The enemy is stronger than expected. Request additional support. Of course he's stronger than expected. You had him in a freaking lockdown container in your own base. And you're suddenly all surprised when you can't kill him? Come on. Really, dude. Is that it? That all you got? Well, land again so we can get this over with. Military's top secret weapon. But what did you mean when you said you will grant me a wish? Bring more Chaos Emeralds. Shadow, wait! I'll be waiting for you in the central control room on the Space Colony Ark. Ark? This is a familiar scene. Only this time, we're going to see about it as Rouge instead. I don't even know what that is. Oh wait, I know what that is. That's that freaking... Oh, I'll show you that in a little bit. Underwater Balcony! So this is Dry Lagoon, and Dry Lagoon is pretty different from Knuckles' first level because it is a water level. And, uh, it kind of sucks because it's a water level because that makes the level divided up a little bit. Not too horrible because, you know, it is the first level and that can't really be too bad, but... First thing we're gonna do is kill these robots, which is gonna cause the turtle to go scooching all the way back into the water. And then we get on the turtle, and we go down! And that takes us to this other part of the level, where we apparently have a gym underwater somewhere. Mm. It's over here? Oh, I see it. It's down there. Only two more. Okay. So let's see here. I don't need to get back on you yet. Guns jar? Guns jar? What the hell does that mean? Admittedly, I've played the hero side stories a lot more than the... Oh. Oh, I thought that was an emerald piece. It was an otter. I see. Grab all those, considering I already have the thing. Let me go over here and see if there's anything. Nope. Okay, so Gun's Jar is probably back where we started. Or it's... No, it's probably back where we started. Let me try just moving around this area really quick. Yep, okay. That's what I thought. Let's go up here. Climb, 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 climb. It's gotta be close. 
Wherever it is, it's... Oh, I see. Somewhere around here. Because it's right next to all these boxes that are gun-labeled. Got it. Okay. So with that done, the other piece is probably going to be back in that other place. So let's go check a computer terminal. If we can really quick. Uh, no, I'm not going to need to. Because I'm already picking it up. Not over this way. Over this way? No, not over this way. So that would mean it's probably... Down there somewhere. Maybe. I mean, I would reckon. Hmm. Interesting, interesting, interesting. I'm not sure how to get down there. On the tilted pillar. Wait a minute. So I gotta get over there. I don't even remember how to get over there. What the hell? I'm not sure what the. Sh <laughs> I'm not sure what to do here. Okay. I'm just gonna break all these out of frustration while I think a little bit. I wish I had a map to this area because I forgot how to get. Because it's, it's through there. I know it's through there. For fact, pretty much. But I just don't remember how exactly we do that in getting through that place. So... Let's take the turtle back. And see if we can go with the turtle. No. No turtle. No? Okay. So that's not the way we get there. So it has to be on this side somehow. Brain is confused. Okay. I wonder if I can go, like, around or something? At least we can get an extra life out of it. What in the heck? How do we get through this? I see. Thank you for that useful bit of information. Um. Well, there's a secret room in there. I know this is really close to it, but at the same time, I can't really fathom how the heck. Unless we have to go, like, underwater here. Yeah, I just gotta figure out how to get, to get through all that. I mean... I think that's the way the turtle came from down there, so... Hold on to the swimming turtle to travel to ah, the I see. Mountain. Okay, I gotcha. So you gotta wait for this turtle to come back. Okay. The turtle that was swimming through here earlier. Got it. So that means we have to do a little bit of waiting. Alrighty then. So there's a turtle. There it is. Hi, turtle. Hi, turtle. I need to, I need to grab... Grab you. Grab turtle. Yay! Whee! Turtle transportation. Hopefully I won't run out of breath. No, that's exactly what's going to happen to me. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Whew! <sighs> okay. That was way too close for comfort. You almost got served, too, Rouge. I guess I took a little too much time. Uh-huh! Uh-huh, you did! You did! Uh-huh. Oh, boy. So, let's drop off the, like, three things we got there. With our buddy. Where he at? Where he at? Where he at? Where he at, Brittany? Where the real Brody? I don't see him. Hey. Right. Where the heck? You're not him. Oh! Oh god! I'm so sorry. I did not mean to do that. Come here. 
We need to give you gifts. I, I apologize profusely for landing on you. Uh, okay. Penguin? You like penguins? Okay, good. You like you like sea otters? They're green for no reason. Uh, there's this too. I guess I can give you a sheep. Sheepy? You like sheepy? Oh, good. You love sheepy. Okay, good. Yay! Let's pet him. Oh wait, no, actually, he's still irritated. Um, pet him, and then give him a pee and he's probably still pissed off, so we're just gonna leave him now. He's he's sad. We're we're just gonna pet him. Yeah, yeah. He probably just wants to sleep. Okay, bye. Got it. I'm cool with that. Sand Ocean. Oh boy, it's another Eggman level. Those idiots will never find my hidden base inside this pyramid. As you can probably tell, we're gonna have a lot more Eggman blow em up levels in the Dark Campaign and then Shadow levels. It's kinda stinks if you wanna play Shadow a lot, but at the same time, Dr. Eggman is pretty freaking hilarious. I have no qualms. There we go. It's just that we probably won't get around to playing a Shadow this episode as a result. Sorry if that was a spoiler for some of you, <laughs> but you're, most of you were probably already able to guess that we would be playing sh with Shadow eventually, considering he was on the screen showing all the characters you can play as and the story. Okay. Let's continue going through here. I think we got a few pillars to knock down, some rings to get. This is a pretty fun level, navigating this base at night time. I also think that the dark levels are harder than the hero levels, personally. Which makes kind of some sense. Alright, there's a chow box over there, but we're not going to bother with that. I don't feel like going out of the way. We'll find another one. Another thing that's bothering me is not having the booster yet. Because the booster makes these sand levels a lot less finicky. Especially parts like this where we could have. Ooh, ooh. I got a little crazy there. Where we could have really used the uh, extra oomph. Okay, there's the chow box I was talking about that we would be able to get. Grab that key and continue pushing forward towards the pyramid. <laughs> I gotcha! I gotcha! You little chuck. Extra life! Okay, let's jump to this platform. I haven't really described all the other, all the, uh, not all the other, all the different types of gun robots, but. You probably got a general guess of what they do by now. They fire lasers, they draw bombs. They randomly show up and then run away for no apparent reason. There we go. As to what gun actually stands for, I really don't know. I'm assuming the G means government. Um I think it's government United Nations actually, but I don't I'm not totally sure about that. Yup, 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 yup. Can I jump up here? Yup. Yay! I got a bat. Blow up some pots. Get some pots. Blow up pots. Okay, that's a little bit useless. I should probably stop doing this. Okay, let's go here. Jump from here to here. Oh god. Spinny ball trap. Nope. Nope, nope, bad spinny ball trap. Ooh. Okay, continue through here. 
blow this up, and blow these up, and this up, and all those up. Okay. Jump down here. And slide on forward, and then jump here. There's actually a lot of bats on this level. I see another one over there. I think we're coming close to the end now. <sighs> Having more Eggman levels also means the Dark Campaign lasts longer, because the machine levels usually take longer to do than the run levels. Eh. I don't know that for certain. I'm just guessing. Whee! Oh god! Let's blow those two up. Lunge up here and take out all these dynamite packs so we can just keep ascending. Going back and forth to Enfu. I think we can jump on this thing up here. Eh. Eh. Ooh, ooh. Don't get smashed. There we go. This is looking like the end here. Oh crap! I've done really good at keeping all my rings so far. Nice, actually. I don't think I got hit really on that level. Hmm, let's see what kind of rank I got. Let's see? Hmm, that wasn't so difficult. Boy. And back to Chow World we go, and this is probably going to be it for now. Next time on Sonic Adventure 2, we're probably going to get around to playing as Shadow. Wake up. Wake up, please. I know, I'm sorry. I need to feed you, because you're horribly under-leveled compared to uh, Chang. I was hoping that I would have the other gardens unlocked by now, too. Um, that might be something I just have to do off-camera. Eh, eh, eh. I know, more irritation. Are you kidding me? Just went back to sleep. You have no respect. None. Let me give you chaos drives. And a bat. Where's a bat? Bat? No! With the Chaos Emerald in the Space Colony Ark. Hmm. I've got to find out just what's going on up there. We interrupt this broadcast for an important news flash. There has been a break-in at the Federal Reserve Bank today. Mysteriously, the only thing that was chaos stolen Emerald? was the Chaos Emerald. According to eyewitnesses at the scene, the suspect was identified as the world-renowned hero, Sonic the Hedgehog. The suspect was seen fleeing the scene, destroying the reserve's guard robots in his path. Stay tuned for Sounds more details. More like the work of Shadow. <laughs> How pathetic. Find them before they escape! I beg of you, please, Maria. do it for me, for all the people on that planet. Sayonara, Shadow.
the hedgehog. I still remember what I promised you. For the people of this planet, I promise you. Revenge!